Work crews listed an 82-ton turbine out of Hydropower Unit 2 at Center Hill Dam, October 7, 2015, from where it has spun with the flow of water and generated hydroelectric power since 1950. They take care of these machines terrifically well. They have a 30 to 40 year uh, projected life. This project is 65 years old without a rehab. It says something about the quality of the Corps of Engineers operations people and how well they've taken care of the machines. The turbine runner is a critical component that actually transfers water energy to mechanical energy and then to electrical energy. And when that turbine turns, it turns a shaft, it turns a magnetic field that produces the 13,800 volts that the generators produce. With disassembly of the hydropower unit nearly complete, the contractor is moving forward with the next steps of the rehabilitation. And we'll start on the rehabilitation of the unit, uh, which is blasting and painting and machining embedded parts and then getting into the, uh, that'll take a few months, then rebuilding the generator, which will take a few months, and then we'll be getting into the reassembly. The Nashville District operates nine multi-purpose projects in the Cumberland River Basin, which produced 2.7 billion kilowatt hours of electricity in 2014. In the same year, sales of this electricity yielded about $57 million in revenue for the U.S. Treasury. The hydropower unit at Center Hill Dam is the first of 28 units at these projects that will be rehabilitated over the next 20 years. The program has a master plan which lays out all of the work that will happen over the next 20 years and includes rehabilitation of all 28 units in the Cumberland River system, Center Hill of which is the first. This is Lee Roberts reporting for the National District at Center Hill Dam in Lancaster, Tennessee.